if somebody has burning in chest it can be gastroesophageal reflux disease i am dr vikas singla today we are going to discuss about a common condition gastroesophageal reflux disease or gut so in our chest we have an organ which is called esophagus or food pipe function of food pipe is to transfer food from mouth to our stomach between the food pipe and stomach there is a wall called lower esophageal sphincter or les in normal condition les is closed or tight function of les is to prevent reflux or food or acid from stomach back into the esophagus in some patients this valve can be loose this condition is called gastroesophageal reflux disease The common symptom of gastroesophageal reflux disease are burning in chest and food or acid coming back into the mouth. First of all, in these patients cardiac condition should be ruled out. So once cardiac conditions are ruled out, we suspect gut and we conduct three tests for diagnosis of this condition. First test is endoscopy. second is esophageal manometry and third test which is gold standard is 24 hour ph study endoscopy is a painless test during which we pass a camera through the mouth into the food pipe and we check for any ulceration in food pipe in 24 hour ph metry we place a thin wire into our food pipe which is which has a special sensor which is called ph sensor so whenever acid comes back from stomach into the esophagus it will sense so with this we look for the acid exposure time so once we diagnose gut we treat this condition so there are two type of treatment one is the medical other is surgical for medical treatment we give a medicine which will reduce the acid formation and during surgery we tighten the loose valve between the esophagus and food pipe now there are endoscopic techniques also through which we can tighten the loose valve uh, so gerd should be diagnosed and treated adequately so that complication can be prevented i hope this video is informative for you if you have any comments or question you can type in comment box below thank you subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates